And we're back! We have defeated seven of the Colossi now. The ruins of their totems are... like... massive. Dust. They're Dust. Gone. Huge. Now let's get on to the next one. And they're very brown, even though the... even though the Colossi themselves... or not the Colossi, but the statues are not brown, the dust that they become is very brown. I, I, get, the, I get the feeling yeah. you're adding artificial length. Not, not on purpose. <laughs> it's just something I felt like mentioning. Yeah. Let's see. Where are we going? Yeah. Yeah. Also, something I wanted to say on last episode but didn't. Continuing from his uh, whole innocent slaughter thing. Funny story of that. Yeah. In games like True Crime, whenever I just got in the car and just ran over countless people on the sidewalks, he always complained and said he hated that. Same thing with Grand Theft Auto, which none of us have any of those games, but same principle. And Saints Row, he So in Saints Row, he runs around murdering people, innocent people sometimes. You know what he says to that when I question his antics? He says, if they didn't want to die, they shouldn't have been in this game. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm sorry, but after... The, every mission in the, in the Saints Row games has you accidentally or unintentionally or on purpose destroy innocent people. So I just said, screw it. I don't care about this particular game. I'm not going to try to not kill people. It's too hard. And Watch Dogs, you get basically penalized if you kill people, innocent people. And well, that just makes driving around in any kind of vehicle a chore. Only if you're not careful. It's yeah. a video game. There is no safe way to drive. I don't know if you. If what you'll... speed limit? There's only stop and go. <laughs> if you obey the laws, you'll you'll make it. Anyway, we've got quite a... We don't have that much of a journey ahead of us, but most of it's going to be on foot. And I'll tell you why shortly. We have to go in this cave. And there's a... There's a lizard there. I wish there was a way to lengthen this episode a little bit with some... Oh, there's something. I'm going to make a quick stop off and get a tail. I don't need the tail, but I want the tail. And since you guys are just watching this, you have no way to stop me from getting the tail. So oh, there's one person's going, no! And another person's clicking stop. <laughs> Except YouTube doesn't have a stop button. So they're stuck with no button to press but pause. I should have let them know there was a pause button. Is wow. that even a white tail? Yeah. Easiest lizard ever. That's no, that would be the one you just run up and hit with your sword, and I've done that many times. I didn't want to run up to it. It might have just tried to run off. How many of these do we I'm have? I'm surprised you got as close as you did. One, two, three, four. We've done five of these. Did you ever get that white lizard in the center of the main shrine that's up in the ceiling? That was the first one I got. Oh, okay. That was the one that was sitting there. When I'm used to being camouflaged because it likes to hide inside of the light. Yeah, the light that Dormin uses to contact you from. Or possibly his existence. Who knows? I doubt it. A being made of light could literally be anywhere if they wanted. Except the dark. Because if they were there, it wouldn't be dark. <laughs> Except for Dormin, because Dormin apparently is both light and dark. But the dark is sealed away. It's not you now. Yeah, that's Wait, wait, we... wait. He had some dark fingers coming at the beginning. Well, it's possible. I don't know, it doesn't explain this very well. The story is left mostly up to speculation and theories. Because mm -hmm. they didn't want to give you a story, they wanted you to figure it out on your own and make your own speculations. I just wish they would give you some kind of shadow or undead enemies pop around the ground on the way to Colossus so I trying to stop you. That would have made things a little bit more interesting. It would have been weird, but yeah, it would have been more interesting in my opinion. Where are we going now? Where where are you taking us? This to is my a, probably most hated Colossus. This is a big place. It's a lake in the middle of nowhere. Are there any fish in this, this water? One. I need to check something real quick, because I'll show it off if I can. But first I need to find fish. Where are fish? Alright, you can grab on the fish. Thank you. I was going to show them, but you No, spoiled. I had to spoil it. It's my job. <laughs> Also looks more like an eel. Yep, you can grab onto fish. <laughs> Grabbing onto fish does nothing. They just drag What was you with around. your leg just there? It's because he's clipping with the ground. He's <laughs> throwing them off. A fish is too close to the shore. Yeah, that's fish for you, gentlemen. Ladies and gentlemen. Or nobody, if nobody's watching this video. Alright, get out your sinking lure and catch the loach. 
Hylian Loach. That's in Hylia. This isn't Hylia. If this were Hylia, I'd cry because it's dead. That's a point. I actually have caught the Hylian Loach in Ocarina of Time, but only once. But I've seen it several times. I even saw two at once before. It took like 30 minutes of sitting in the middle of the water with the iron boots on. <laughs> Just don't disturb the fish. I always thought it was a hoax until I actually caught one. We have a long way to go in an area where we can't take the horse. Although we're almost there. Just a little bit further along these passages. At least I got my trusty Dr. Pepper by my side. Mr. Oh, Doctor. Dr. Pepper. I forgot Pepper. to pick me up with trusty Doctor. I forgot to doctor something. I'll do it later. How else am I ever going to get my doctor? Mr. Oh no, I have a sunburn in my arm. I'm going to the hospital. Hey, it didn't look like a sunburn. It looked like something was growing on my arm. We told you it looked like a sunburn. To you guys, but you guys aren't medical experts. Where's your degree? I have a degree in baloney. I have a degree in I'm trying economics. So it's not economics, it's yep. actually art. The moment we enter this place, the Colossus is active. His name is Kuro Mori. I'm not sure if I pronounced that correctly, but if I didn't, I'm sorry. I'm not Japanese. I still don't remember and this I have one. not studied Japanese. You Which are white bread. I don't recognize this music. How can you not recognize it? How many times did you find this guy? What is he? Kurumori reminds me of a giant gecko. Also, we need to get its attention. Hey, Shingus, up here. Strike from one electric enemy into another. Yep, only this one's a little bit more dangerous than the last one. They're each a little more dangerous than the last one. What else is there? This boss actually has a projectile attack. Oh! And he can climb the walls. And that's actually the key to beating him. See, what you want to do is you want to get his attention off to an off... No! You don't want to jump off. That would be dumb. Why do I still have my sword? I want bow. There we go. I got the bow. You want to lure him up farts? as high as you can get him. And then uh, shoot him in the arms. Legs. Um, Robert. Once you hit one... He'll stop attacking, and then you can hit the second one easily. Then for the annoying part, getting down here quickly and without dying. Just hold R1 as you fall, you'll usually catch something. The secret to this boss is the higher up you go, uh, the, the longer he'll stay knocked out from his fall. Quick jump strike! But jump strike! I don't wanna. You want to be it's careful. It's like the easiest time to ever do one. You want to be very careful. Okay, when he starts moving like this, you want to get off. Don't risk fighting him anymore, because if he turns over and you're underneath him, it Switch. has the potential to one-shot you. Time to run. No, that time is already past. He's been there. And he's back on his feet. Now, what's dangerous about this boss is you heard him make a noise when he was attacking earlier. He's shooting static electricity, incredibly powerful static electricity, into the area where you currently are. And uh, if you're caught in it, it will chip away at your health constantly because it's an area of effect attack. Magic infinite arrows! Fire! Here, I'll show you. Come on, see me. Come on, charge up. You must have gotten the infinity enchantment. Couldn't you have gotten flame as well? Hey, you! Have you even seen me? Here we go. Wow, he's a really bad shot. If you're standing anywhere within that mist, you're taking damage over time. So it is important to be careful. 
and you would be surprised how fast your health goes down when you're in that thing. I think if you're standing in it at full health, you have maybe three or four seconds to get out of it. Ooh. Depends on your health, though. I said full health. As in full? You never had full health. We don't know what full full health is. Well, if you're anything like me, your health is going to be similar to what mine is. Considering I haven't stopped to uh, pick up that many fruits, I think I picked up one. Which means your health, if you haven't gotten any fruits at all, will be slightly lower than mine. Where is he? Or Shinja. There he is. Aggro can't save you now. Did I'm hoping that I can get his attention like that. If not, I'll have to shoot him with an arrow, which means i got to go to one of those areas with holes in the walls. Can't shoot the grates? I can, but it's very awkward to do. Especially if you're trying to hit him below you, because you don't have very good line of sight. Hey, it worked! Hold still, you! did some damage, but it's not enough for me to worry about. I should be able to finish him off now. That should have broken you. Oh, you guys ought to know better than that by now. Jump strike, just do one, come on. Oh, he's already getting up. That's weird, he shouldn't be doing that yet. Time to go. Get off! I got knocked off. That's... Uh -oh. well, that saved your life. This boss might take a while. So He's already wait. back on his feet. He should have been knocked out for a lot longer than that. Maybe it shorts every time it happens, but it shouldn't have shortened that much. Maybe I wasn't up high enough. Well, you were at the top. Hmm. Should have his back legs this time. I was racing. Okay. Hey, Zoro. Cut it. Okay. What? That's it? <laughs> what we told him? Yeah, I told him to stairs. cut it. We didn't think he'd actually do it. They should have more faith in it. One piece. Gotta love that one piece. No, you must keep going. Gozer's at the very top. Tell me when we get to twenty. I'm gonna throw up. Hey, I'm up here. I think he does. What's up, big guy? Tell him you're a god, he might go away. <laughs> the other name they give to this character, I believe, is called he's called the Wall Shadow. Which makes sense because he's a giant black colossus that crawls on walls. Giant black colossus, huh? Why you gotta be so racist? It's not racism. <laughs> it's colorism, not really. Alright, now I can shoot him through here. Back leg number one. Long ago, the four races lived together in harmony. Then everything changed and the white people attacked. Uh, he's not falling. I can't see him through this light. Can you, like, yeah, that. This is the way I would like to normally do it, because you can get down way faster. And safer. Come on, rush him! Charge that thing! Let's go, boys! And jump strike! I missed. Failure! Quick, get him! One more, one more! Quickly, quickly! Quick stab. Come on! It's not enough! Wait, no? It's not him? dead? Oh, this is gonna hurt! Oh. Uh. Ooh. Look at his health bar, he's got like nothing! Shoot him in the arm! That won't finish him. Right, you actually have it to... It has to be a sword strike to finish. Right. Really? That was ridiculous. Just get him to climb up a level or two. Man, this level's got... This this Colossus has got artificial difficulty all its own. Alright, that's, that should be good. Take him down. All the way down. To Chinatown. USA. 
Get up here, ugly. I bet aggro's out there somewhere like, how do I get to him? You probably can't even hear my whistle, or she. Uh, um, she can, oh wait, she tends to I don't you. know, she can be like at the shrine and still hear you. But she follows you if she can be followed, that's the thing. I don't know. One time I, I jumped off a really high cliff to survive. A few. Yeah, it takes a long time for her to go all the way around to me. I got quite the distance. Ah, uh, nothing I can grab onto. Oh well. Run, 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 run. Finish it, finish Lock it. on. Time to finish things. Wow. Uh, Already? What? Quick! Kill it! Kill it with stabby stabby. There we go. That was ridiculous. That was, that was crazy. Ah, I can see it coming for me already. Stay away. There is no escape. Everybody dies to call Sam. <laughs> well, that was Kuromori the Wall Shadow. That's eight Colossus down. We're halfway home. Goodbye, everybody.